This fraud is indeed bad. The administration's bungling of this mess, though, is even worse. From Americans for Tax Reform, Maddie Dupler. Maddie, how the heck does this happen? <laughs> Neil, that's a good question. And you mentioned it before. You know, there's got to be a better way to do this. There's got to be a way that you can spot billions that's being wasted in the Medicaid system because, as you know, we're spending almost $400 billion a year in this program, and it's not helping anyone who needs to get uh, that kind of aid. So, you know, you look back at this administration, which has told us time and time again they're going to be, you know, the champions of transparency and open and honest government. You look back at the stimulus program where we were told we'd be able to track dollar for dollar where that money was going, and none of that transparency ever materialized. So you can see why when you're spending $100 million on a Medicaid audit program, no audits come up telling us any money is being wasted. It's also convenient, I think, for this administration to have an audit program that doesn't find any waste because, as you know, focusing on an audit program then distracts from you actually having to focus on the entitlement program that is going bankrupt right under your nose. Well, you know, I, I wouldn't m even mind spending $100 million. Let's say if I found a billion dollars in abuse. It's sort of like right. these companies that get these consulting agencies to say they save money and they spend like, you know, $20 million in the consulting agency, but they save, or, you know, hundreds of millions of dollars over the course of years. Then, uh, you know, it, it, to me, it sounds right. outlandish regardless, and it, it, if that's <laughs> what you have to pay to, to be fiscally prudent, then the, mm -hmm. there's something wrong with you, but, but it is what it is. But Washington keeps doing this. This is just a more glaring example. I wonder, this came to light in this Medicaid investigation. Who knows where else it's happening? Right, you're absolutely right. And, you know, we see this all the time with these types of programs. The SNAP program is rife with uh, waste. You know, what used to be known as food stamps, you've got people buying and selling the SNAP debit cards on Facebook right, even. You right. know, and this thing, you think this stuff you could track down easily, but it seems that since the government has absolutely no interest in actually showing us where our money is going, they don't want to actually, you know, be able to grab these easy, uh, these easy savings and say, listen, at the very least, we support the program. We think what we're doing and spending here is good. We're going to do it in a way that we can at least prove to you that we are using the taxpayer dollars the way we told you we're going to use them. They're not even interested in doing that. So God only knows what's going to happen when these payrolls uh, 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 continue to grow under Obamacare. You know, we're expected to get 20 million new people on the Medi as a Medicaid enrollee under Obamacare. And of course, federal taxpayers are on the hook for 100% of those costs. Yeah, just do it. Do the math. Do, do the math times 20, times 50, times 100. You, you, <laughs> the man. Uh, good stuff all. Maddie, thank you so much. Thanks, Neil. Well, Governor Brown wants more green. His